The fascia is a connective band in the foot reaching from the heel to the toes. When this band gets stretched too far, slight tears can form, resulting in a condition called plantar fasciitis. Parkview physician Dr. Ashley Bojrab explains that the structure of your foot is often the culprit. Plantar fasciitis is the number one diagnosis that it, it typically is, and that's due to structure of the foot. It happens in quite uh, the variety of patients. Um, typically do, like I said, to structure, also tight muscles can also cause that problem. What is the best indication that you have plantar fasciitis? They can't walk, it's hurting. But then as they're walking a little bit more, then, then it's, the tendons and ligaments loosen up a little bit and the pain starts to alleviate. So they are able to run. It's after I get done with my work, I sit down for a little bit and then I get back up, I can't because it's so painful. Those are the typical signs and symptoms that we would see with plantar fasciitis. Upon receiving a diagnosis for plantar fasciitis, your podiatrist will put together a treatment plan to help you get back on your feet. We'll want you to do some stretches four to five times a day of doing stretches, very vigorous amount of stretches. Um, shoe gear is very important, stiff soled shoe. You want to make sure you have a good insert into your shoes as well. Something called an orthotic may, might even be helpful. A prescription orthotic might be helpful. Icing the area, sometimes oral medications such as non-steroidal anti-inflammatories, your ibuprofen, Aleve, things like that you could take. Becoming then a little bit more aggressive, you would do something like injections, splinting, physical therapy and things like that. While this condition can happen to anyone, Dr. Bojrab explains that there are preventive measures, starting with supportive footwear. You really want that foot to be more of like a tripod structure, a nice solid structure. When you have a more of a flatter foot and it's starting to collapse the arch or a higher arch foot, you get that tripod structure to support your body weight. Changing your shoe gear out, let pain be your guide. If, if you haven't changed your shoes out in four to 500 miles, it's, it's probably about time to change those shoes out. This has been Making the Rounds, brought to you by Parkview Health.